So we'll have to do that in a better location. Perhaps on the other side of our base that we had found not that long ago. But this, this is what we're looking for. This is what we needed. This is the meteor. See, it's a different kind of coloration. This is the meteor we need. Now, the piece that we need is in the depths of it. So it's like directly in the middle. There should be like a, a chest in the middle. And the chest looks the same. It's called a skystone. Skystone chest. It's gonna take a little while. I have the right pick to get through this as the sky stones only require a uh, harvest level 10. So you don't even need iron to get through this. And I have... What's this level? This mining level is fantastic. So finding that, uh, finding that dark iron as early as we did was fantastic in jumpstarting our setup. Alright, so let's, uh, let's get this here. Right, diggers. It's picking up that. Uh, so you go to diggers, grab the cobblestone out of there, make it place right there, and we put the diggers away again. This is going to take a little while, so don't be surprised if this is skipped. Marion has left the world. I never looked into it in a while was my achievement book. I take a look into that and see what's, what achievements are for me to grab. <laughs> oh, poor fishy. The flowing water moves and they spawn and they come and they meet their dooms. Was, oh, both meteors have seemed to land here. Interesting. I've got a sky stone and some dust. I was picking up the fish. So I see. There we go. Mine is probably one of the things I do with yet. Oh, this is a game of Can't sleep. Oh, yeah, can't sleep. Well, that's awesome. Cool. The clean bag is fantastic. Jim Pro 44 with it away. Fireworks. Oh, explosions. What's going on? Crazy going on. I know a dark temple. I suppose no dark temple. I have to go there soon. I'm actually curious what I can do with evil craft. It's not a lot of, I really worked with it before. I'm gonna find. Alright, so I'm finding the gods to be interesting. Because early, early on, we're told that one is the god of order, one is the god of chaos. But the god of order had asked me to do something that seemed a little chaotic. And the god of chaos had simply asked me, well, not really asked me, offered to build a smelter that I'd taken because I was being a little chaotic in the way of taking it. So it's interesting to think. They're acting like what you'd expect the other one to act. I guess that's how brothers are. They more likely seem to realize. So this whole thing. Oh, but one, one god I've not heard much from, or anything from really, is Dunos. God of change. That's the one I'm really curious about. What is his deal? What, what, what does he want? We think they're changing, that's for sure. What does he want exactly? What is, what is his goal? That's the curious one to me. I haven't known that current exchange was laying on both powers, both the gods in general. So, so I thought by using it, it was going to go against the order of things, and the Sumerian would get upset with it. I got kind of figured. I didn't, under, didn't know that Zeron would also be affected by that. So that's news to me. It's good to know. But we decided not to continue its use, so I mean, it's not like to worry about that anymore. Where is this darn chest that we're supposed to be finding this thing? Unless they change the way this stuff works. There's a possibility. And actually, with, uh... With this, uh... Skystone, it looks really dark colored and stuff. I can totally use this as the shrine for Xeron. Xerion. Xeron, I'm bad at pronouncing names. Um, so interesting. enough. Totally could do that. Um. I was like I'm almost all the way through this. I don't. There's a fallen meteor inside of this. Skystone chest. There it is. Awesome. Inscriber calculation press. All right, cool. 
I have found one of the pieces I require to do this. Woohoo! A whole bunch of explosions just happened, and I got hurt. Oh yeah. Something just landed here. Look, freezer right. Temperature, freezing cold. Oh man. What is freezer right? Free... Freezer gloves, packed ice. Freezer right crystal. Can be used to create a freezer from falling meteor. What does a freezer do? Interesting. Uh, it looks like it's... I can mine this up, perhaps. Maybe I can get the crystals before everything melts. No? Oh, there's some crystals. I'll take those, why not? Some sky stone, yeah. Some ice. So it seems like I have gone to like this meteor, almost like meteors just land here all the time kind of thing. <laughs> They're like three meteor, four, three or four meteors have crashed here, all in the same spot. Ooh, appetite. Use that for farming stuff. I'm not sure how much of this I need, but I'm gonna grab a whole bunch of it. Copper as well. Fire-infused stone. I'll take those. I'll grab my luck one, actually. Out of durability, sadly enough. Oh well. Got the copper. Yes, okay, so that's one meteor. We found one of the presses, right? So required. Yep. Yeah. Um. So now that I have one, I can create more of them, but the only way to create one is I already have one. I need to find the other ones the same way I found this one, by finding more meteors like this one. I must mark as claimed meteor. Right. Meteorite. Uh, marker group. Uh, just do all I think is fine. Maybe we get right. Basically, making, making sure that I know that that is one that there's no point in going back to. I do remember the town. Did I get the stuff here? I did not grab the stuff here. The steadfast drone. Unknown diplet. The stuff I did not get. From this dark shrine, altar, whatever. Looks like a dark yen. Sleeping bag is awesome. Oh, that's right, that's the other spaceship I saw. I uh, can't quite sleep yet, but it shouldn't be too long until I can. Let's see the spaceship. Yeah. Market station. Right, do you remember the weapon station? I see yeah. Nope. Oh, there we go. Go through the night.
stuff in here. Yep, more stuff in here. Another meteor keeps. Uh, these meteors are falling more and more often. A little scary. A little scary with all the meteors. Alright. Big meteors. I gotta find another one. Gotta find another meteor. Ocelots. Look at them. They're space kitties. Is that the meteor just fell? The space kitty meteor? There's space kitties! Uh, I had fish. No, don't, don't run away. I got fish. Space kitty like fish, right? Space kitty should like fish, right? Let's find out. Here. Space kitty. Come here, space kitty. No, don't run away. I got fishies. I got fishies. Eat the fishies. No, don't run from me. Space kitty. See? I like fishies. See the hearts? There we go. Ooh, rubber tree. Awesome. Rubber trees are fantastic. I can do uh, industrial craft stuff with the rubber trees. And I don't know what happened to keep today's kitty. Today's kitty is gone. Oh well. Let's actually toss that for a minute. Wait, there he is! Space kitty. Hey, you are, space kitty. Don't worry for me, space kitty. I want to be our friend. I'll take you home. Make you a nice little uh, wool bed. It'll be great. You crashed here on this planet, so why not let me help you? Fine, run away from me. It's cool. Whatever. Still need meteors. I'm running out of space at this point. Another desert town. How's it going, strangers? What is this that you have built here? This is a wooden contraption. Looks like you were trying to build a house and then didn't. Okay, let's like see the analyzer. Now that thing at a... Yeah, that was definitely a seed analyzer. How do I make one of those anyway? Seed analyzer. Sticks, glass, and wood. Okay, no problem. I'm not gonna take theirs. I made that pretty easily. A lot of crops here though. I have to venture here again, see what's going on. A whole other setup here too. Full smeltery. Got a, an actual well that generated without any issues? Oh wow. You guys got all the things, don't you? Feels like a pretty cool town. I wonder if Dudos has a town, and if not, I wonder if this could be his. Dark boots, some iron, box of eternal closure, forgotten player, heal craft stuff, bad time. Alright, cool. <laughs> so, so apparently, um, Good, our good friend has recently saw what we had, our, uh, what we had done to his base in an earlier episode.
The brushers are not considered Okay. It has something in it excluding the Avengers back back. Can Ryan Flash pick up as such? Yes. How about that? It's not everything that you think would go in the bags go in the bags, but there is a number of things that do go in the bags. How about the record? Nope. Uh, so what is this? Box of Eternal Closure. Okay. What does this mean? Contents. Forgotten player. What's this? I don't know what this is. Shift for info. Pain and sorrow. My dark boots are waning. I'd like to find some more dark ingots, honestly. Let's see. Required, dark ingots required. What exactly? Steel dust and obsidian. But it's not horrific to get. So we can make it the old-fashioned way without too much problem. A lot of people in this town. Well, I'm not seeing anything spectacular about this particular town, but I mean, it's a good, nice little town. Plenty of people in it, they're doing their thing. It's a good size, too, like, like it's a pretty, almost like a city, more than a town. Bigger than the other two towns. There's another evil craft altar over here. So we're totally gonna check out that evil altar. As per the normal. And a chance cube. Oh, how they taunt me. Here we are. There's definitely a chest on there, so let's see what the chest is all about. This one chest looks like. Yeah, just the one chest. There are a lot of things here. We have a safari net. Ooh, dark steel ingots. Awesome. Ender pearls, pearl gray tea, and oh. Okay. I think Zerion has left us a message. Let's go check it out. A cry and shame drowned. <laughs> I think that was one of those spa random spawns that we keep seeing. Like, Peter and stuff. That's hilarious. <laughs> Hopefully it's not a terrible omen of my death. But, alright, let's read this book, shall we? Uh, small minion, you have only provided enough energy in your prayers for... The main component you're missing, check your recipe. Wait, why is this? Check the recipe again, meet your possessions. That's what you need. For my powers to grow, I need a larger, more extravagant place of worship. My villagers, in desert town, I'm missing a smelter, which I had rebuilt for them. Yep. I feel maybe follower Marine. Kind of follower? I don't know if I'd call myself a follower. See, the outfit is with a wall. Yeah, I, I did the wall. Bring my people back, their smeltery. Prepare for war. Why is always war? Treat your fellow to assist me. The village needs own walls. People protect it with the light prevent by the being stirred up by your rival. Get them area. Okay. So it seems like it's the same one I read before. Almium ingot as well. Nifty. I throw this stuff down and like I can pick it up, put it in there. Fill in things. 
Alright, I need to be able to carry these more stuff with me next time. So the same book as we had before. That we had seen before. That's it's no big issue there. Like I said, I'm not I really consider myself minion of a worshipper of his really of Mirion. It's just you know, when God asks you to do something, it's either you do it or you fight against him. And I wasn't really prepared to fight against him. So a simple request of building a wall. Or well, protecting his people, quote unquote. I was built a wall as a protection. You didn't really define how the protection were to proceed. I kind of just interpreted it as such. But nevertheless. Um can't carry everything that I have currently. I have too much stuff. I want uh, well, the stuff in here isn't going to hurt me for not having it. The unknown dimlets might like to use those for stuff. Uh, beetroot seeds, I don't have those, I don't think. Belladonna seeds I can get easily, we'll get rid of those. Take them dimlets. They stack? They do stack. Okay. I don't really care for the rubber, I can get that later. I mean, it would be nice. Um. Would leaving the book here be a detriment to Zarion? I think, because I've already read it, that he won't mind if I just leave the book and take the Thalmium ingot instead. As it's kind of hard to get Thalmium ingots properly. As I'm not prepared to get them yet. But I have read your books, Zarion. Need not worry. I understand the plight of your people. I have plans. You need not worry. This does look like it's one of the meteors. It is. A smaller one, but it is one of the meteors. Looked like it had taken some damage already. Hopefully the sky chest is still intact. And that the pieces that we need are still in there. There's the chest. And there's the piece we need. Calculation press. Of course, it's the exact same one we already have. Of course that would happen. Some copper ingots, or nuggets. We need those. Ah. The other presses that we need beyond the calculator one. I think there's like four of them. And I think copper altars are in order as well. Man, there's so much things on my to-do list. Agile crops, A stuff. So much things I wanted to do. What is this? What is? You have a house made of wool. You have a house made of wool. Huh? Oh yeah. Oh, it's a. Oh ho ho! You are an archaeologist. Can I speak to you? Where are you? Where'd you go? Archaeologists. This is a tent. I just saw you say, did you find the hole? You totally found the hole. Okay, archaeologist, talk to me. Ancient fern spores for emeralds. Okay, so you want spores for emeralds. That's fine. Um, so you're not, you didn't, you're not what I thought you'd be. I thought maybe it'd be a case of like, I could get fossils and stuff from you, but that's not the case. So, not nearly as useful as I'd hope you'd be. Skull lantern, nice. Why is someone else calling me so for the recordings? I wish I got to meet my phone. Alright. So this is an archaeologist camp. It's called a lantern. The flag. Okay. Nifty. Alright, so let's go check out the altar. And then we'll continue checking out the archaeologist tent. Sorry, I had to turn off my phone's sound. 
case someone calls back again. Alright, so let's come up here. Oh. Climb up here. What do you got going on here? <gasps> A saddle! Oh, that's awesome! That's exactly what we wanted. We wanted a saddle. And a bunch of other things, just... What? What's going on? What happened? There was stuff in there that just disappeared. Darion? Are you doing stuff? Did not load properly? I'm not sure what's going on. Alright, I'm gonna leave this alone for a second. I'm gonna go over to the archaeologist spot again. Maybe it's glitching, I don't know. Maybe Zerion's messing with stuff. It's always possible either way. I'll leave that be for now. Let's check out what was this. This was an analyzer. Some fossils. Okay, archaeologist workbench. How do I use this stuff? How do I make this stuff so I can make it myself? Analyzer. Analyzer. Computer control CEO. Analyzer forestry. Analyzer. Requires, oh. Probably scrap biofossil. And ingots. Iron ingots. Okay, so that's nothing too spectacular. And a work bench work. Okay. So, work bench. A bunch of different workbenches. Fancy workbenches. I have the, uh, the engineer's workbench, but I still haven't figured out how to use immersive engineering completely. Oh, where is the archaeologist one? That's mechanics. Clockwork engine. Work table. Archaeologist workbench. A work. a crafting table with a paper. Okay, so this is really, really simple stuff to get into. So I might have to do that. I might have to get into archaeology. Because we've got plenty of fossils that we've seen, and there's fossils here as well if we wanted to dig those up. Check those out. But I feel like taking from the archaeologist who's already here is just wrong, so I'm going to let him do his thing. Let's come back here. Check back up on this chest. Okay. Improvements. Okay. So this is another zero. So this is what. So zero was doing stuff with the, with the chest, which is fine. I figured that's what he was doing because I saw a little book there for a minute. Let's check this out. I'm zero. Thank you for returning my villagers smeltery. A proper shrine to me in the colors of black and purple will slowly increase my powers. Black and purple. Ooh, good colors. Dad's favorite color was purple. We totally can work with that. Your previous actions could be set aside for transgressions towards my people. Okay. You could also increase my powers by rebuilding my worshippers' houses, increasing the size of their town, introducing new foods. My brothers think you new mortals have only brought destruction and chaos. As this is my specialty, I can see this could be used. Increase their homes, expand their areas. With the construction of Miriam's Wall, it can only mean that he thinks these times can be used to finally rise up and go to war. Weird how the one of order wants to go to war. I still find it so weird. Miriam doesn't make sense to me. He's supposed to be the god of order, but he's asked me to create so much chaos. Expanding their town, bring them the technologies of your far-off civilizations, your culture, as it is. It caused them to pro pro uh, provide more faith, build them a large temple to worship in, so they have proper place to worship. Also, a hot springs. Build it, and they will come. Okay. <laughs> In the immortal world of Pepe, the King Prawn what? <laughs> you don't know of him? Hmm, perhaps I was leaning it on my culture. Okay. So. The request for 
from zero and has been made in. Hello. I am Grace with your presence. That was a mighty weapon you have there. I will do what I can. It might take some time, but I see no harm in what you have requested. You are welcome. Alrighty, um... So things are getting tense on this world. That is for sure. Uh, another content... Forgotten player. What is this? Your small prayer so far have allowed me to manifest again. Well, I'm glad some assistance has been made. My... I, if I may ask, these temples, these, these evil temples that have... Well, I guess it's from evil craft, but it doesn't necessarily mean that the temples themselves are evil. But these temples, are these temples yours? Or are these temples from some other realm? These temples come and truly after you new mortals came into our heavens. Oh, okay. So these temples are new. They're not among the gods. Probably means it's some kind of cult thing, which cannot be good. Make sleep for the night. Alright. So long, Zerion. You go off and do what you... what you do. The saddle's fantastic. Box of Eternal Closure. Forgotten player. I'm not sure what these boxes are. I know so little of Evilcraft. So, so little. I want the saddle, though. Um... Master of Tin, Level well, Master of Iron, this was an Iron, yeah, that's Iron Pickaxe. This is a new pick that didn't properly work, that uh, I can probably get rid of and not worry too much. I want the saddle. Can I stack these? No. Come on, a number of things that are in this. Avengers Backpack, you're just taking up space, you're not doing me any good. You have become a burden to me. Dense blood? Insert into any machine for extra blood. Okay. More evil craft stuff. Ender pearl dust. Okay. I can leave the melons. Take the safari net. Leave that there. Take the box of eternal darkness. The eternal closure. Nether Quartz, Gunpowder, Wheat, Ink Sack, and everything else here. Nether Warts, I should like the Nether Warts too. I can always grab more Nether Warts. Mega Rubber Tree Sapling? That's interesting. Uh, what to leave behind? Decisions, decisions. Oh, I can leave the Sky Stone behind. I don't need the Sky Stone. Or the Sky Stone chest. The Sky Stone itself I want to keep because I want to make an altar out of it. I can totally leave that and keep the nether wart. Alright. Of course I need soul sand to even start growing it. Or at least now that I have it, I can get it started. Right, let's make our way back to base, which is going to be in this direction. Another temple here as well. And I just watched the meteor crash into the ground. Hmm. Nice. Everything's on fire. I thought meteors only came at night. Apparently that's not the case. Day, night, doesn't matter. They appear when they appear. But yeah, that crashed right into the ground. Meteors are not friendly.
Hmm. Slime ball? Alright, let me put this book down. Seems to be another book here. Same one from before? No, so thank you. Okay. Build the road from village to village. Yeah. Gotcha. And slime ball. Okay. Anything new? Nope, nothing new from there. Alright, let's build a bookshelf. Oh, I can actually store books. Oh, those are simple. Okay. Book over here. Make some planks. Let me put the wood back. Okay. Bookshelf. I need to clean up my base. Alright, so there's many things left to do in this world. Oh, I have a saddle now, right? Yeah, I do. Yes! Now I ride my horse. Saddle of armor. Your rope or something or string? How does this work? Is there a rope? There's a string. A lasso, maybe? Is that what it is? I think I need a lasso, right? Golden lasso. Not what I want. Maybe it's just string that I need. Charm. This lasso. Golden lasso. That's something else, though. Don't recall. Safari net should work fine. Safari. Safari net. It says they also have single use. Jailer safari net. Released creatures don't despawn normally. Safari net with iron bars. Safari net reusable. Okay. Safari net launcher. 300 pearls and a gas tier. But it seemed, even though it's single use, it seemed to work. Well, oh, there it goes, it went away. Okay, so there are single use. I forgot that I had two of them, so. There goes Safari net. I don't think I have a gas tier, do I? I don't believe I do. I've not created a world's nether. Obsidian. One, eight, nine, ten. Alright, so I do need to build up my base a little more. 
be a little, a little better. So we'll see what happens. We'll start building out some. I might pick as well. We're actually going to end this episode for now. We'll go back on in a little bit, continue on with what we're doing. For now, this is Grand Shame. I hope you're enjoying the series, the mystical world that we are in, all the craziness that's been ensuing. So, for now, Grand Shame, signing out. Thanks for watching. If you liked that video, hit the like button below. If you'd like to see more videos like that one, hit the subscribe button. If you like to get notifications, make sure to hit that bell. You can also check out our website for more information on different games. If you would like to support us, check out our Patreon page for more information on how to do so.